dead. Good. This is the pool that thing came from. The parasite now writhing behind your eye. nothing more than meets the eye. got out. Might be other survivors. Might still be stuck inside if we hadn't been attacked. Images of goblins, their habits and histories flash into your mind. into your mind. Nerves, sinews, as much living being as ship. A feeling penetrates your mind. An anomaly, one like ourselves, unconnected from the whole. Caution. Let's see what this does. Worlds beyond worlds flash before your eyes. Empires of a grand design traversed by ships just like this. years of humanoid history, elves, dwarves, humans, and more, flash behind your eyes.
You've come to save us from this place. From this place you'll free us. Please. Before they return. They return. A newborn. Born new from this husk. You realize you're talking to an intellect devourer. A minion of the Mind Flayers who abducted you. The enemy! So many enemies! Remove us from this body! From this case! Free us! a dema, a swelling of the brain causing pressure where it strains against the shell of the skull. strange creature, making it more subservient, should it prove a threat. doesn't do anything.
it. Your head throbs and your skin tingles. Visions rush past. A dragon's wing, a silver sword, and a flash of your face seen through the strange woman's eyes. Oh. My head. What is this? Squall. You are no thrall. Flakith blesses me this day. Together, we might survive. We carry Mind Flayer parasites. Unless we escape, unless we are cleansed, our bodies and minds will be tainted and twisted. Within days, we will be gay. Mind Flayers. Nothing until we escape. That must be our priority. First, we exterminate the imps. Then we find the helm and take control of the ship. We will address the matter of a cure for this infection once we reach the material plane. Things well. I am fury. I am death. Breathing, despite everything.
Let's have a look. to do. Never wanted the easy path. Oh, action, not reaction. One true way. I won't withstand these dragon attacks for long. Forward! too alien. Nothing looks familiar. Soul appears dormant. Seem more like a beating heart than a machine. 
Perhaps it will open the nearby pod. Looks like there's plenty of fighting ahead. Let me come with you. We can get off this ship and watch each other's backs along the way. I did. It must be because of those parasites they put in us. But that'll have to wait. Are we going to help each other or not? to get to the helm. Now. She's right. Lead on. At least things have stayed interesting.
indolence breeds madness. It's no time to waste. next. in his eyes, but he seems totally unaware of his surroundings. I should speak up. The man isn't dead, but he's totally unresponsive. prisoners, but they do not react. Let's see what this does. Faint images appear in your mind. A brain, a good Yankee warrior and centuries of darkness.
history. woman is trapped inside the pod. She doesn't notice you. controls next to the pod.
positioning. Efficient path. We are nearing the helm. Once inside, do as I say. Who put you in charge? I'll trust my own judgment. Kenyak.
What's hiding here? Take this! Or Zarya will have your head! room for more. Hits the ground, we're dead.
on my way.
as you wake, the tadpole squirms in your skull. Other than the infection, you're more or less intact. A miracle, given everything you've been through. But it'll all be for nothing if you don't find help soon. The tadpole is a death sentence, and the clock is ticking. You need a cure. as my feet can carry me. 